I believe you guys will be able to relate with me. As an editor, you have to deal with a few clients where they will provide you low res video clips to edit with, but they will expect you will magically make those clips very high quality, crisp and clean. So how you can solve that issue? Here it comes AI RT Video Enhancer Tool. AI RT Video Enhancer and AI Power Tool designed for content creators and video editors who wants to transform low resolution noise footage into stunning high quality visuals so let's see how you can improve your footages using ai art video enhancer tool. this video is sponsored by ai rt but today i'll share my experience how this software works how you can use that and of course they will provide you free trial so that you can try yourself and see how this software works so with ai Atri, what you can do you can upscale low resolution videos to higher resolutions for professional projects then you can remove noise and fix footages shot in poor lighting also you can recover detail in blurry clips even something as challenging as a blurry eclipse you can create smooth slow motion effects from videos that weren't shoot in slow motion and lastly this software is perfect for creators working on mockups promotional materials or polished content that demands quality in this video i'll walk you through how you can use ai at video enhancer tool step by step starting with multiple ai generated clips that are low resolution and blurry and i also will share you real life clips that you can process with this tool before i show you the process you can simply click on the link in the description below to download ai rt and follow along with me so here is the user interface of ai rt the user interface looks very clean and user friendly you can click and drag the footages or click on this plus icon to import clips it supports batch processing too if you need to process multiple clips it got you covered i want to start with this bird clip as you can see the clip is a little bit blurry let's see how ai a tree can help us to improve it once i click and drag this clip here you can play it back and in real time you can see the improvement by using this before and after slider sometimes you don't need to process the whole video in this kind of scenario you can select an in point and an out point now it will process the selected section only the right panel contains all the controlling after selecting your desired properties you can click add task to add the clip into the task queue like that you can import multiple clip and add them in the task list queue to clear it from the task list you can click on this cross icon from the hardware section select the best possible hardware it can vary depending on the computer you use i'm using m4 max so i'll just select cpu and gpu if you're using windows computer you might need to select your gpu for optimal performance you will get three ai model here more detailed hq v2 model will generate more details and it supports up to 4x upscaling use smooth hq v2 model to eliminate flaws for the videos it is perfect for scenes with people indoor lighting or moderate imperfection and it is also supports up to 4x upscaling super video vhq is optimized for low light denoise and it supports up to 2x upscaling so for our bird clip we can select more detailed hq v2 ai model from the upscale section i'll select 2x upscaling the more upscaling option you select the more time it will take check turbo for speed i mean if you do not want to wait that long but if you enable turbo you have to sacrifice the quality slightly i'm not gonna use that they have included edit option to give you the opportunity to crop rotate or basic editing from here i don't need to use this one too next the frame interpolation it is important if you want to increase the frame rate of your video i mean if you need to slow down your video then you can select your custom frame rate from here for this clip i don't need to use this one too ai actually also supports audio processing enabling audio processing you can denoise your audio if your audio has background noise it can eliminate those background noise and lastly export setting i'll select mp4 from the format then h.264 from the codec option and aac for the audio codec once everything is done you can select export to original folder to export the video clip to its original destination or you can select a custom directory from the output path I'll export to original folder then click export current to export this current clip only if you have multiple clip added in the task queue then you have to click on the batch export for me it's export current depending on the clip duration and complexity 
the export time will vary. So if I show you the before and after, here is the before. And here you can see the bird is very blurry. But if I show you the after, here it is. It has increased the details and if you look to the edges, you can see it is very very sharp. So if you want to upscale your video, definitely you can try AI Tree Video Enhancer tool. I have also tested several clips. Here is another one. This is the before. It looks blurry and I wanted to slow it down a bit more. So I have increased the frame rate to 120 FPS. Here is the after. Also with this landscape, I have upscaled the resolution to 4x. Here is the V4. You can see the landscape resolution is little bit lower. So if I upscale it to 4x, here is the after. Lastly, with this night clip, you can see a lot of grain. After applying the AI video enhancer, here is the output. I really like the software. They have a free trial where you can process up to two minutes long video clips with watermark. Their plan is also affordable compared to the competition. I'll put a link in the description below. Click on the link if you want to try that. So that is all for today. I hope you have liked this video. If you have liked this video and learned something new, then you can definitely give me a thumbs up and if you can this channel, want to learn video editing, want to learn about different filmmaking gears, then subscribe to this channel to get more. I'll see you in the next. Until then, goodbye.